I am Nathaniel Richards, a descendant of Reed Richards, the genius known as Mr. Fantastic. But my potential was stifled by a dull utopia. I became fascinated with history and discovered the time travel technology created by Victor Von Doom. Bored by the perfection of my time, I constructed a time machine. I arrived in ancient Egypt crowned as Pharaoh Ramatut. My knowledge made me a god among men. But even gods can fall. The Fantastic Four traveled back in time and threatened my reign, forcing me to flee back to my own time. I refused to be defeated. My lineage was cursed by their meddling, but I would become more than Jonathan Majors. As the Scarlet Centurion, I devised schemes to manipulate time and outsmart my foes. My conquest was just beginning. The Avengers were naive, but they were also a challenge. I sought to break them, to make them my puppets. No longer just Jonathan Majors, I embraced my destiny. I am Kang the Conqueror, and all of time will bow before me. The time machine became my throne, a vehicle to dominate eras. I would rewrite history as I saw fit. Victor Von Doom understands power, but his vision is limited. Together, we could reshape the world, but he will always be a rival. In the 40th century, I saw an opportunity. A society rich in resources, but lacking in knowledge. I rose as their ruler. Power felt intoxicating, but conquering worlds was only the beginning. I wanted to control the flow of time itself. I sought the Earth when it was young and unprepared. The Avengers would fall before me. I fought them, capturing their greatest heroes with ease. The time for my victory was at hand. But heroes are resilient. Wasp's cleverness saved them, turning the tide of battle against me. Defeated, I activated my time machine, desperately trying to escape, while the Avengers regrouped to stop him. Time is a cycle, and my vengeance would be patient. In my quest for power, I found love. Ravana Renslayer captivated me, but she was a prize I could not easily claim. I offered her my heart, my empire. But love cannot be forced. She refused, rejecting my dominion. Her betrayal hurt, but she sacrificed herself to save me during battle, igniting my inner conflict. She chose honor over power and I lost everything. Grief transformed me. I became a force of chaos, scattering timelines in my relentless pursuit of revenge. Immortus was a reflection of my own failures, a reminder of the man I could have been. We were destined to clash. In Limbo, I discovered the threads of time. I could see all the ways I could change the past, but the cost was great. I altered time, saving Ravana from death, but in doing so, I shattered reality, creating new timelines filled with chaos. My actions birthed countless variants of myself, each a fragment of my ambition. Now I must confront them all. With the timelines fractured, I prepared my armies. Each version of myself would be a weapon in my war for domination. I sought out my variants, each a different aspect of my ambition. Together, we would reshape the multiverse. The Avengers stood against me once more, but they were no match for the might of my combined selves. My technology was unmatched, each weapon designed to exploit their weaknesses, to bring them to their knees. But victory came with a price. In the chaos, I saw the faces of those I had once loved. Was this power worth the sacrifice? Ravana returned, a reminder of my humanity. She challenged my choices, but could I turn back now? Uh, could I abandon this path? The power I craved was intoxicating, but the price was my soul. I chose ambition. The throne of the multiverse awaited, and I would stop at nothing to claim it. I had become the master of the multiverse, each timeline bending to my will. 
but with power comes endless conflict. Heroes rise to oppose me, fueled by hope and the belief that they can alter fate, but they were naive. I unleashed chaos, reminding them that I was the architect of their doom. Hope is a fleeting shadow. Immortus challenged me once again, the embodiment of my lost potential. Our battle would determine the fate of the multiverse. Betrayal ran deep, even among my own. The ambition I had cultivated bore its own venom. I unleashed my might, a cataclysmic force against those who dared oppose me. The multiverse trembled before Kang. In my pursuit of dominance, I became a harbinger of destruction. What legacy would remain of Kang the Conqueror? Perhaps there is still a path forward. Redemption may elude me, but I will forge a new destiny, one that embraces my humanity.